Hey, hey everybody, it's me, Shadow Strike, and welcome back to another video. It has been like over a year since I've last made one. A uh, lot's happened since then. I moved out. I live in a bus now. It's blooming freezing cold. Uh, my mic also broke, so I don't have that at the moment. I'm currently using my face cam audio. Um, so yeah, audio may not be spectacular, but you guys can just deal with that. Uh, today, we're going to be playing You're Not My Neighbor. I've seen like heaps of people playing this. I haven't actually watched any playthroughs myself, so I don't 100% know what it's about, but apparently it's popular, so we're gonna play it. Um, yeah. Warning, this video game contains flashing lights. Okay. Nice. I can deal with flashing lights. Oh! Oh! Oh, I can move! What is this? 3312... I don't know what that means. Can I click any of this? I don't know what I'm clicking. Oh, okay. What does record mean? What does that do? Oh, record. Doppels you allow in. Captured doppels. Neighbors killed. Times killed. Times you survived. Oh, jeez. Okay. Let's go back to the menu then. Uh, I'm a little bit nervous about this. Play. I genuinely don't know what I'm doing. I haven't... Okay. The doppelgangers you let in don't kill you imme immediately, but at the end of the run. Get a score rank at the end of the run according to your performance. Possibility to poss possibility to find and complete the Chester's quiz. What the flip is the Chester's quiz? I don't know. What okay. I don't know what the Chester's quiz is. I don't know what's happening. Oh, oh, there's a thing. Little movie. Please tell me what to do. All right. The following short film is a production of DDD with educational fines. What does that mean? <laughs> Hello, if you're watching this film, it's because you're the new doorman in our building. Or in your building. Okay, I guess I am. Your job is to determine whether the person who wants to enter the building is a doppelganger. Okay, I can do that. As everyone knows, doppelgangers have the ability to transform into another person and impersonate them. Sounds, sounds lovely. But some are not too good at it and could generate imperfections. Okay, so I just gotta look for ones that look stupid. You have to pay close attention to the appearance of your neighbours. Also, remember to fill out the checklist for each neighbour. Oh, I got a checklist. Okay. Well, this sounds easy, right? You can't miss any detail because it could mean death for you and your neighbours. Oh. Well, this is the structure of your office. Now we are going to explain how it works. Okay. Okay. Let me know. Here is the security window. Don't forget to observe very well each individual who approaches. Okay. Okay, sounds simple enough. On the right side, you have the folders with all the data of each neighbour according to the respective floor. Nice. To fill out the checklist, take one of the lists in front of you. Guys, I can't read properly. I feel like I'm mucking up every single word. <laughs> Receive documents from this hatch. Why are they giving me documents? If you determine that an individual isn't a doppelganger, then allow them into the building with these buttons. What if I just purposely went in a doppelganger because I want to know what happens? <laughs> Otherwise, if you determine that it is in fact a doppelganger, press the emergency button and call 3312. Okay. Will they come and exterminate them? To communicate with the DDD or any apartment in your building, use the telephone in front of you. Why do I, why would I need to call anybody? Can I just look at them and be like, nah, you ugly, you can't come in. Your job is really important, so make sure you do it right. Y yeah, well, I mean, if I don't, everybody's gonna die, so... Finally, we can congr congratulate the doorman of the month, Henry. Oh, good job, Henry. I'm gonna overtake you. It wasn't that he did an excellent job, but he was the only doorman in the area who didn't get killed by doppelgangers. Oh! Well! Be like Henry. I strive to be like Henry. Oh, but better. Yeah, I strive to be better than Henry. Okay, Henry, you are my competition now. I'm gonna beat you. Because I'm better. Genuinely, guys, watch me win. I d Oh, hello. Welcome and congratulations on your new job. I don't think this is a very good oh as you can see on the introductory film your job is to verify the entry of the neighbors of your building oh each day there will be a list of individuals who will request entry to the building okay it is possible that there are individuals who request entry and aren't on the list 
In which case, you will mark on the checklist that they are not on the list and proceed to question the individual. Oh, that's how I'm going to die. If they're not on the list, that's how I'm going to die. Also, you must verify that the ID and the entry request are correct and have the respective DDD logo. What? Don't forget to also check the expiration date on the ID. Okay, this is getting harder by the second. Remember, it's February. I'm not going to remember that. February 1955. I wish you good luck. I'm not going to remember anything of what you have just told me. I'm, I'm, okay, I, I, I think I'm officially too stupid for this. Legit, what am I doing? You are horrifying. Hello, good afternoon. I just don't want to let you in because you're ugly ass. Entry request, name Nasha McKaylee's apartment F0204. I'm a resident of the building. I come from my job as a chef. Right, you second floor. Oh. Where is... There, this one, you. Oh, I'm going to have to remember. Right eye blue, left eye green. I do need to check that. Right eye... Is it my right or their right? Wait. Right eye blue. It's like, okay, yeah, that's correct. I don't... Okay. Curly hair. Yep, she has freckles around face. Physical appearance matches up. So what else? She's a chef. Yeah, that matches up. Nasha McKaylee's. That matches. ID number... Oh. 78965 78965 3665 Where did it go? What the flip? Oh, you're on today. Why did it disappear? Why can't I click it anymore? Bro, I was trying. <laughs> you have an entry request. Wait, no, what? Wait, wait, what does entry request mean? Uh, uh. Oh, yeah, she does have an entry request. Entry request appearance is on today's list. I don't know about the ID. I didn't get to check it. Yeah, we're just going to say yes. And we're going to let you in. Hopefully I didn't screw that up first time. I mean, surely not. I mean, I don't know where to flip my... Bye, have a good oh, it's time. right there! Oh, I, oh, I should have... Oh, I could have checked. You know, I'm sure she's fine. They're not going to give me... A... Oh, wait! Wait, I have to close it! No, I didn't realise! Good afternoon! I didn't realise that you had to close the door again after! I didn't realise you had to close the door! I'm sorry! Oh, I just let some stranger in! I don't... Him. Oh, I probably just flipped and screwed up. Oh, who are you? Steven Rudboys. You look flipping ugly. Well, you don't have an entry request. Oh, no, you do. You don't have your form on you. Steven Rudboys. What apartment are you at? 4-3. Guys, it's... It's Dr. W. Afton. <laughs> Guys, it's William Afton! It's the man behind the slaughter! Well, he can't come in. Francis. Oh, is that the milkman? I've seen so many, like, reels about this milkman guy and how everybody thirsts over him. So, let's... He, he doesn't even look good, guys. Oh, there he is. Stephen Rudboys. He's a pilot. Big nose, wears glasses, short hair, small head. R Rudboys. Oh, are they retired? Are they related? They must be related. Okay. Big nose, wears glasses, short hair, small head. You don't have an entry request, though. That freaks me out. Your ID is probably the best one to go off of. 565845. Oh. 5658454555. 4559655. 455965. 555965. Okay, well, your ID matches. Appearance, ID. You don't have an entry request, but you are on today's list. I have to question the individual. How do I question them? How do I question them? Two hours later. Oh, wait. Wait, I'm I'm actually legitimate an idiot, guys. But we already knew that, didn't we? I gotta go here. I gotta go ID, appearance. There's not entry, and then go question. I'm, I'm sorry, yes, I forgot to show my entry request. Oh, he does have it. I'm resident of the building. I come from my job as a pilot. Ah, cool. So he's all sweets. 
So quick, close the door before the next guy breaks in. I think this random guy here is the guy I accidentally let in. <laughs> He's probably like the, the like the doppelganger or whatever, and I just let him in because I didn't realize you had to close the door. Yeah, you're good to go, lady. Let's just close that. I swear I've let someone in. I don't want to look at that. That ah, oh, I don't want to look. No. Oh, I'm, I don't want to look. I'm covering my screen. That ah, oh, I don't like that. No, no. That reminds me of this weird dream I had, where like my feet looked like that. The bottom of my feet looked like that. Horrendous times. Trypophobia, guys. That's a trypophobia warning. I don't like this guy. He's a doppelganger, one hundred percent. Look at his face. I mean, there's no way this guy just genuinely looks like that. I mean, he hasn't got any... Yeah, nah. Get out. Get out, bro. Three. 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 One. Two. Get this bro out. Get this bro out of here! I don't trust him. I've... Oh, you have contacted the DDD. Yes, I have. Take this man away. A group of agents has been sent to your building. Good. Take him away. Please wait for the cleaning protocol to run. Oh, you're gonna clean him. How does that work? Do I get to watch? I would like to see, preferably. What's being done? Oh, hello. Cleaning protocol completed. That was a guy, right? You can continue your job. Oh, thank you. Bye. That was lovely. Good afternoon. Hi. How you doing? You are not on the list, brother. What are you trying to do? Arnold Schmidt. What floor are you? No, I don't know what to say. If I two, Arnold Schmidt. Resident of the building. I've my job as a writer. Oh, you're a writer! Yay! What right what do you write, Arnold? Schmidt. Big eyebrows, prominent. Where's a hat? Oh yeah, you're wearing a hat. You're all good. Round face, short hair. Your hair is not short! You grew it out! Your hair, brother, is not short. Look, can you flip the photos of my papers and compare them well with me? I am. Your hair is not short like it's meant to be. Look at that. Your appearance. You're not even on the list. Bro, you're, you little... Wait, no, he does have an entry request. To undo that. You're not on today's list. Am I not on today's list? No, you're not. Stop trying to break in. I think there's an error. I shouldn't be on the list. No. Look at the list again. You're not on the list, brother. You're not there. I don't trust you. Your ID matches it. Your appearance does not. You have an entry request. But... I don't trust you, mate. You're not coming in. It's your question. Nah, you can get out. Go away. I don't want you. Three, three, one, two. Ugly mother. Trying to trick me? Why did my game break? Oh, there we go. Get rid of him. Yes, I have contacted you. Can I just get that? Yeah, we don't need that. Oh, hello. Cleaning protocol completed. Imagine I accidentally got some innocent person killed. You can continue your job. I was planning on it. Well, lovely times. Hello, old man. Good afternoon. Hello. Who are you? Alf Capuz. Cap 1960! Hey everybody, this is me um, editing this video in my minion onesie and my chicken nugget hoodie. I just want to say that this next part of the video is bringing me physical pain and I know for a fact that it will bring many of you physical pain. Let me just put it forward that, you know the little like the dates on the bottom of the ID cards? You are all probably a lot smarter than me and realize that that is the expiry date for the ID cards.
I don't know why, but when I was playing, I forgot the whole thing about the expiry dates and I thought that it was the birthday of these people coming in, which probably leads to the most stupidest, my, my stupidest moment in gaming, honestly. Like, I apologize greatly for what is about to come. I would remove it, but I pretty much stick to this like the whole way through the rest of the video. So now you are forced to watch it and I apologize greatly for what you are about to see. I am an idiot and now that I am watching it back and editing it, I am in physical pain. It hurts my soul to see how stupid I was. I'm so sorry about that. Anyway, um, back to the video. 1955, I'm sorry. So are you five years old? Are you five years old, sir? It's 1955 and you're saying that your birthday is the 8th, 1960. So you're five years old. You were born five years ago. <laughs> Sir, that is suspicious. That is highly suspicious. What floor are you on? The third, third floor. Four. Use a monocle, wears a hat, round face. Lawyer. Yeah, your lawyer's right, but you were born in 1960. That doesn't make any sense. You're on the list, but you... You, you were not born in 1960! Surely not! Surely you're a faker! Like, come on, you can't be born then! That doesn't make any sense! Does it say your birthday here? No, it legit doesn't. Does it say it here? No, it doesn't. Well, how out? Where else am I meant to like double check your birthday? What if you do have it? What if? What if you're just a really old-looking five-year-old? Like, how am I meant to tell? <laughs> what the heck? I don't know. I don't trust this guy. Check the ID. One two zero five four. One two zero five four. The IDs are always the same. Eight zero nine six. Eight zero nine six three four seven three. Yeah, IDs are the same, but I don't trust you. You are not born in 1960. There's no way. And like, and like when I first, like in the tutorial, it made it very clear. This is 1955. Remember that. This guy was not born five years ago. He is not five years old. Wait a second. 1955. How no, I, no, I'm stupid. I'm not stupid. Five years ago would be 1950. Oh, I'm an actual idiot. No, he's five years forward. He's saying that he was born five years into the future. Not five years ago. He's not five years old. He was born five years into the future. I'm actual, I'm sorry. I'm actual such an idiot. No, he was born, <laughs> he wasn't born five years ago. He was born five years into the future. 1960s later. Oh, yeah, now nah, you can get out. Now nah, you can get out. Three, three, one, two. You were not born five years into the future. Help! Wait. Get rid of him. Get rid of this guy. Bro, this is actually so easy. This is so easy. I think for that one guy accidentally let, let through at the start. I better have been right about that old guy. Hey, see the old guy's back! 19, why are you still 1960? And it's not 1960 yet. Why are you back? Your birthday is not flipping. I don't understand. One two zero five four. Why are you back? One two zero five four eight. Two zero five four eight zero nine six. Zero nine six three four seven. You what? I think I don't. Ah, oh, do do the date? Do the birthdays actually really matter? Like, do they? Because I've got the same guy again, and he was not born in nineteen sixty. Right? It's not nineteen sixty yet. Just. 
I don't trust you. Get out. Okay, these these birth dates have to just be randomized. Like, there is no way. 1975. Have I been just been missing the birth dates all this time? Because it's 1955. Woman. A seamstress. Curly hair, deviated left eye, round nose, big smile. What do you mean a deep? What does a deviated left eye mean? Your eyes look the same. As if it's facing the wrong way. So you're not. You're you're a fake. And your birth date's wrong anyway. What's wrong with my appearance? Your eyes not looking funny. It looks the same. Look carefully at the photos of my papers and compare them well with me. Yeah, I did, and it's not okay. I just go. I don't trust I don't trust anyone in this building. And your birthday. Why are all your birthdays in the future? You were not born in the future. Like, sh I have to be getting this right. Surely I'm getting this right. I, I am questioning my sanity. I feel like this game is gaslighting me. <laughs> I have to be right. Surely. Surely. Um. I swear, I'm just, like, killing a bunch of innocent people. I have to be. Like, there's no way I've gotten this many fakes. The doppelgangers, like, in a row. I mean, your IDs match. And you were on the list. But I don't trust you. I will end everyone in this building. I don't care. You're all just gonna die. And, um, you know. You're all a bunch of fakes. <laughs> Mole on left cheek. They... S they spout cheek wrong. I just want to point that out. Small pointed nose. Slim long neck. She has a twin. Legit. Well, your appearance is correct. You have an entry request. You're... Oh, are you on today's list or is that your sister? No, that's... Yeah, you're on the today's list. It's just your ID I haven't checked yet. But the ID is always the same. 845323. 845323. 014. 0149 oh, The birthdays must just be there to throw me off. Because everything else matches. Excellent. The door, please. Do I want to let her in? I mean, her birthday. 1980. It's 1955. <laughs> I don't know whether to just trust my gut and not let her in. But I feel like I've just let so many people, like, not come in. Ah! Oh, I... D I'm going to let her in. But I don't like it. I don't like it at all. Not one bit. Did I screw up? Level summary. Doppels captured, I captured six, so they were. No, oh, I killed one neighbor! Doppels you allow in, zero. I killed one neighbor. I got a rank A. How did I kill it? I killed a neighbor. So I killed a real person. Well, who does it? Ah, so the da the birthdays may must not matter. The birthdays must just be there to screw me over because they don't make any sense. Like, how could how was it 1955 but they were born in 1980? That doesn't make sense to me. I don't know, <laughs> but I mean, I I must have done it right. Is there like harder modes, or is it just this one? Because I did flip an amazing first go, except for accidentally killing a neighbor, but you know. <laughs> I'll skip that. I don't want to watch that again. Oh, I should have watched it for the birthday thing. Yeah, never mind. You know, never mind. I don't care. I'm just going to check everybody's birthdays. Yeah, I don't care about that. Oh, there's more people. Hey, it's the milkman that everybody's so obsessed with. I want William Afton to come. Oh, William Afton. Oh, he's right there. It's William Afton. Dr. W. Afton. You know, I just don't think he should be allowed inside the building at all. Whether he's a doppelganger or not, I feel like he should just be not be allowed in. I feel like the safest option. What is he? He's just like a physicist. Oh. Dr. W. Afton. I don't trust you. Not one bit. Wait, what's his birthday? 71. 
Yeah, all their birthdays are in the future. That makes no sense. It makes me so confused. I was just killing people because I just assumed that, like, their birthdays were all mucked up. But clearly, clearly they're not. Clearly, he really was just born in the future. Apparently. Wait, wait, wait sorry. I forgot to check your floor. Wait, it's not your floor. Three, one. William Afton. Physicist. Yep. Robust eyebrows. <laughs> Wears glasses. Short hair. Round nose, square head. Short hair, round nose, square head. Yeah, you look pretty similar. I mean, you're, you're there. You're on the, you're on the thing. Appearance matches, on today's list. You've got an entry request. So you're, haven't checked your ID, but I honestly could not care less because the IDs are always the same. Five two five two five zero four. Two five zero four. Eight nine six five six. Eight nine six five six. Two one four. Yeah, you're all goods, bro. You're all goods, brother. Is everything in order? Yeah. But I don't want to let you into the building anyway, because you've probably got dead children in your apartment or something. So I'm gonna keep my eye on you. And I will call the cops. Um because I don't trust you, brother. Now he one hundred percent has dead kids in his apartment. You are a horrifying woman. Where are your eyes? Yeah, I will open the door. Be patient. Don't rush me. Or I will kill you. Like I have accidentally killed an neighbor before. <laughs> 42. What is this? 42 what? Can I let him into the building? Who is this guy? What the flip does the 42 stand for? Reason. One plus one plus one plus one plus one. <laughs> Who is this man? Should I let him into the building? I feel like I should 100% let him into the building. I feel like that's a good thing to do. Have fun! I feel very confident in that decision. I think that man was 100% a normal human being and he should definitely have been allowed in. I mean, after all, his reasoning was 42. Um, his name is 42. Uh, I think I think it works. I think he should definitely be allowed in. You're all good. Excellent. Yeah, you're welcome. Yep, I'm getting there. Why do you all rush me? Goodbye. Have fun with swirly face, man. Sure to love the discuss with you the significance of the number 42 yeah you look normal good afternoon hello sir i'm gonna get an s this time no i'm not gonna get this because i let the swirly face man in <laughs> what's the point of me even trying i let the swirly face man in all good man yep everything's in order yes i'll open the door i hate when they ask me to do it for them it makes me not want to do it you honestly sir you probably don't want to go in there 42 men will probably kill you as soon as you enter. Hello, old man. Yes. <sighs> no, yeah, you will not understand the actual anger it makes me feel when they ask me to open the door for them. Get out. Oh, what the? Oh, I hate you. Good afternoon. Um, no, it's, uh, my afternoon is ruined after seeing your face. Oh, it's the sister. Hello. Where is your stuff? You know what this, but you don't have your ID. Here's my, thank you. Thank you, I don't know why you didn't think this was a good idea to give them to me. I already let you in. I've already let you in. I No, don't you dare try and trick me. I already flipping let you in. I let you in. It was your sister I haven't let in, in yet. Nah, don't give me that. Don't give me that. Don't give me that. I've already let you in. Left cheek. So why she's a twin. They need to fix that spelling of cheek. <laughs> um, 
Your appearance matches up, but like I already let you in. I swear I already let you in. Oh, there's no way. On today's list, you have an entry request. Your ID matches up. Your appearance matches up. Ah, oh, I don't want to let you in. Wrong one. I don't want that one. Um. Left mole on the left cheek, yes, definitely. It's on the left. I already let her in. It wasn't this twin I let in. Was it? No, it was definitely her. I've screwed up anyway. <laughs> Who cares if I screw up more? Who we got next? Oh, right, it's that milkman guy everybody's obsessed with. Mm, hello. Yeah, what's up, man? Do you know how many people sip over you? I don't know why. Look at you. You're you don't even look that that good. I'm not I'm not seeing what other people see. I'm sorry, mate. What do we got? Francis Moses. Interesting name. Uh, well, you're on the list because I saw you there before. You're an You're on today's list. Your appearance. Wait, I'm sorry. I always forget to check. Four, three. Long nose. Thin chin, tired eyes, short hair, wears a hat. Yeah, you've got your hat on. Yeah, I think you're all sweet. You brought your ID in. Have fun, milkman. Go and hide from the crazy people who want to marry you. I'd be hiding too if I were you. I think I should definitely let him in. <laughs> Did you get acid poured on your face or what? <laughs> you don't want to talk to me using words? Well, you're not doing a very good job at convincing me, but I'm going to let you in anyway. No, I'm not. I'm kidding. Get out. Fellas, help me please. I wish you could see them, like, dying. That sounds terrible. Why is there three of them who have all showed up now? Well, this is the sister. Well, you are on here indeed. I do. Were you second, third floor? Nope, you were on the second floor. Nope, you were on the first floor. <laughs> Mole on right cheek. Yeah, your appearance matches up. Have fun. No, just shut the door up before she can get through. <laughs> a happy guy. Ever dreamed this clown? Every night all over the world, hundreds of people see this clown in their dreams. If this clown appears in your dreams, don't play any game with him. If you want more information, go to... Oh, he left. I was going to let him in. <laughs> I was just going to let him in, but he left. He didn't want to come in. I don't really care about that. Can they make it a little harder to spot the bad ones? Okay, go like, look at this. Clearly she's not okay. What is wrong with your appearance? Yeah. Clearly you are disgusting and you should be killed. They need to make this game harder. Like, legit. Come on. Why is he back again? Nah, get out. I'm not doing this. Thank you. I would love to continue my job. I don't get paid enough for this. <laughs> I think that. Because I definitely let her in twice. And one was definitely 42, man. I purposely let him in. But what other three, did, what other two did I let in? What the heck? Okay, I take it back. This game is, this game is flipping harder than I thought it was. I genuinely don't know where I went wrong. 
Can I see? I wish. Oh, I can see the details. Yeah, 42. Isaac, he had fake documents. Fake documents. Did I forget to check, like, the jobs or something? Maybe I didn't look at the numbers for them. Wrong head. What do you mean wrong head? Well, I knew that I knew that she was a high possibility she was wrong. Because I, I, I remember there being two of her and I was like, why are you back again? But I let her in anyway. He, him, Roman42, I purposely let in. Okay, I knew he was bad. I just let him in because I thought it would be funny. I can't believe I let four in. And I was just saying, oh, that should make this game harder. It's so easy. No, I just let four of them in. Two of them were not purposeful. One of them I was a little wet. You know, you know about. I actually can't believe it. I'm so mad. That is anger inducing. You know what? Rank B. Lovely. We got my records. Wow. Neighbors killed one. Times killed. I've been killed one. Times he survived one. I can't believe I let four in. I can't believe that. What the heck? Oh, whatever. Whatever. And that everybody has been. That's not my neighbor. If you want me to play more of this game, then I don't know. Say in the comments, leave a like on this video, subscribe, I don't care, whatever. I'll play more of this game if you guys want me to, or if you have any other game suggestions, please let me know those too. I am really excited to be getting back into making videos again. Um, hopefully I will have a lot more coming out. I'm going to try and set myself a schedule, because I'm really bad at that. But yeah, thank you all for watching. Uh, like, subscribe, and I'll see you in the next video. Strike out!